So yes, we can move easily from one screen to another screen to another screen. So it's very easy and we can press back button to go back to our previous screen. But we are using navigation dot push. So here we can see we are using this navigation dot push and because this country map required the name of country and the latitude longitude we need to pass it here but instead it will be good if we have some kind of routing system so that we don't have to write these things and we don't have to pass data every time so how this is going to work let's see so firstly we will go on the main function where the application starts so here i can simply say create the routes and if you are not familiar with the what kind of things you need to give in any kind of uh, argument so you need to just go inside that uh, widget which we you are using and you can see this route must have firstly a string and widget builder map so this represent it is a map and map of a string versus widget builder so we need to give here a map first thing is the name string as the name of route so i will say country hyphen map this is the name then a widget builder so widget builder will accept the context and the widget to which you want to navigate or the screen so screen name is country map and we need to import it at the top like this and that's done but we are getting error because our country map widget or country map screen need these two things whenever we are initializing but we cannot pass these data because we don't have these data on our main application so we need to tackle it with a different approach what different approach we are using is like instead of having the constructor here i'm just going to get the data from the route and how this is going to work let's see so here i will create final country is equal to modal route dot of context and then i will say settings dot arguments and because it need context i can push this inside this build method okay so this country has to be a map because i'm going to pass a map of countries that will be country name and country uh, let long so here comes the country name because it is a map so i can do this and same thing i can do like country and at, actually at this has to be lat lang so lat lang so this file doesn't have any problem but the problem is inside this country dot dart file here we are just using push and we are passing these lat lang and the name as for the constructor but, but we have removed the constructor so let's just remove quickly all these push thing and now i will say push named route and route name is country hyphen map and next argument is the argument and that has to be a map so i will create a map of name which is country name then comes let lng and country let lng so save this file and it will hot reload and now if i try to search for any albania show on map and yes you can see we are having the map a location on the map for albania and title app bar title is also the country name properly so let's try one more another random one so chile oh uh, yeah we have that so this is working fine so let's quickly do the same thing for our country so one more route come will come here but you know we generally forgot the name actually so when i was typing here i need to recall my myself that what name i have given so it will be good 
if I can move the same naming thing on this country map. So I can say static function, uh, a static variable, static, it will never going to change. So it, it will be static const and it will be route name is equal to slash country hyphen map. So now I can easily grab this like country map dot route name so now it is very easy to remember and same thing we will do for country so the country will have static const route name is simply country and that has to be slash country okay so here i can say country dot route name will have a context and move it to country but we need to give a comma here and as we know country also required country details country as a map so i can remove this constructor i can remove this final country and now i can say final map of country is equal to modal route dot of context dot settings dot arguments and now it will going to work finally and this time one thing we need to do more we need to go all countries and here we are using this push named uh, push argument so instead of push navigation it will navigation not argument so push named route and this time i'm not going to say country because i know i have that so country dot route name and the argument will be uh, it will be simply country so i will just type countries and comes index so super easy things are there so let's just check this and then we will once again recap before ending this video okay so we are on this page and if i click on any country mm -hmm, we have some problem here it says country all these things are going there we can't find generator for the route setting country hmm, let's just hot restart this because hot reload doesn't care about the main function so hot restart it and now we have list which is restarted now the application is restarted and let's try once more for japan and yes you can see japan is there and we have everything for japan and we can move easily to the map of japan so this is all about the named route one thing more let's go to uh, country and here also i will use the name route name instead of hard coding the word so country map dot route name super easy things it will going to work i know so let's just end this video and if you are enjoying this video share this video with your friends and don't forget to like bitfumes on twitter facebook instagram linkedin we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye